गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर यू के यादव सर्विंग फॉर लास्ट ट्वेंटी फाइव ईयर्स एंड प्रेजेंटली एट जवाहरलाल मोदी विद्यालय समस्तीपुर बिहार इन कंटिन्यूएसन विथ द थर्टींथ चैप्टर ऑफ क्लास नाइन एन सी आर टी वाई डू वी फॉल इन लेटेस्ट डिस्कस रिगार्डिंग द मीन्स ऑफ स्प्रेड दैट मीन्स द हाउ communicable diseases transmittable diseases are being spread from diseased person to healthy person as if we will be aware that how diseases are being spread then we can keep ourselves away from those factors and that will lead to healthy life so let us discuss in detail these are the various means through which the pathogens the microbes the disease causing organic spread from diseased person to healthy person that means the means of spread may be air water and food sexual contact through vector from my own diseases and animal body so the communicable diseases most of the communicable diseases they are being spread through air that means through droplet infection suppose now in time the disease due to which we are fearful that is covid that is being spread through the exhaled air through air if we are coming in contact with the person who is suffering from flu who is suffering from influenza who is suffering from tuberculosis who is suffering from pneumonia then what will happen the patient will exhale or sneeze cough then the pathogen along with their air exhaled there are some vapors of water water droplet and along with water droplet these pathogens comes out in the surrounding and when the persons they are around them they are the around the diseased person the infected person they all are inhaling the same air and they will be infected so it is a very vital and hence the person who are suffer they must be isolated so that it will not spread to the unaffected person to the healthy person through water and food the disease like cholera diarrhea these these pathogens are being spread through contaminated water if suppose there is leakage in the water pipe then what happens the pathogens the dirty water mix into the potable water and that leads to cause of the water borne disease the contaminated food the ascaris the spores of ascaris the pathogens distributed in air the fungus they are available everywhere and when food is in open for longer period of time then there will be contamination of food and that will lead to diseases that means the pathogens are traveling along with water and food by sexual contact we have heard the term hiv or the disease aids and they are being spread acquired immunodeficiency syndrome they are being spread through sexual contact that means when a healthy person will come in contact with the diseased person sexually there will be physical intimacy physical relationship only then these diseases are being spread like gonorrhea syphilis aids so by casual contact it will not be distributed it will not be transmitted suppose a person suffering from aids if we are remaining with them playing with them working with them hand said there will be no spread of aids it will only communicated it will only spread through the transfer of saliva through the transfer of body fluid through the transfer of blood so when the blood is being transfused from infected person if the person is hiv positive then to whom the blood is being given they will be hiv positive from mother to inborn baby 
from lactating mother. So these are the very limited scope that AIDS are being spread. So we have keep a cordial relation with the person who is suffering from AIDS. उनके साथ उठने से बैठने से खाने से खेलने से एड्स नहीं फैलता है इन बातों की हम लोगों को जानकारी होनी चाहिए थ्रू फैक्टर मेजोरिटी ऑफ द डिजीजेस लाइक कालाजार लाइक मलेरिया दे आर बीइंग ट्रांसमिटेड स्लीपिंग सिकनेस दे ऑल आर बीइंग ट्रांसमिटेड विद द हेल्प ऑफ सम टेन वेक्टर्स वेक्टर मींस वेहिकल्स वेक्टर मींस कैरियर वेक्टर मींस इंटरमीडिएट होस्ट दे आर कैरिंग द डिजीज फ्रॉम इंफेक्टेड पर्सन टू healthy person that means these pathogens are really vip they need vehicle aise nahi jayenge unko gaadi chahiye machhar ke dwara jayenge makhi ke dwara jayenge ye sabhi kya hai ke vectors so through vectors diseases are being spread foreign born diseases sometimes the diseases like corona they are being distributed when we are touching the object that means the pathogens are sticking on the objects of daily uses like door knobs keyboard of computer mobile table all the articles pen spectacles they are the object and with the help of object the pathogens are being transmitted from diseased person to healthy person therefore we must not share all these belongings अपनी सामान खुद रखें खुद उसका प्रयोग करें किसी दूसरे का रुमाल दूसरे का पेन दूसरे का चश्मा के प्रयोग करने से बचें क्योंकि हो सकता है उसके ऊपर पैथोजन हो और फिर ये पैथोजन हमें बीमार कर सकती है दैट इज फॉर माई कॉल नेक्स्ट वन इज एनिमल बाइट सम ऑफ द पैथोजन लाइक रेबीज वायरस दे आर बींग ट्रांसमिटेड बाय द बाइट ऑफ मंकी बाय द बाइट ऑफ डॉग so these are the different means different modes of transmission of diseases here these are the examples of diseases caused by different means common cold pneumonia tuberculosis corona these are air borne disease spread from person to person through air cholera hepatitis diarrhea scariosis these are transmitted by water by contaminated water contaminated food by sexual contact it is also termed as std sexually transmitted disease syphilis gonorrhea genital herpes candidiasis vector borne diseases like malaria filaria dengue typhoid cholera they all are being carried by the vectors by house fly by mosquito different types of mosquito culex female anopheles cc fly sand fly these are the vectors of diseases and by fomite borne from object cold sores diarrhea covid these are the diseases spread through touch on the infected object from the contaminated object to the person the healthy person and through animal bite rabies this is also termed as hydrophobia the name of the disease rabies is also hydrophobia that means the patient will fear of water because they will feel problem even in drinking water so it is also termed as hydrophobia so after knowing all the means of spread of disease how the diseases are being spread now we can keep ourselves away from all the factors that means we must take care of our personal hygiene and as a community we must discharge the responsibility to keep our surrounding clean there must be provision for availability of fresh drinking water availability of fresh air and there must not be garbage dumping nearby the residential area there must not be any industry installed from where there are chances of contamination like tanneries jahan chamde ka udyog hota hai chamde ka refinement hota hai wahan kya honge wahan chances hai bahut adhik bacterial growth ka aur phir wahan ke जो सराउंडिंग होंगे तो उसमें डिजीज स्प्रेड होना दैट इज वेरी कॉमन 
so thank you all of you for making the video feel for watching the video lessons and hope you are enjoying the lessons it is our request that kindly share the video like the video and feel free to comment what is to be done for the betterment of your understanding thank you milte hain hum log next agle video mein agle chapter ke sath agle sub topic ke sath tab tak ke liye dhanyawad thanks